Hey guys, Tactics Thief here. Welcome today to this trading method, which is going to be a silver, extremely cheap trading method. And as you can see, I've only got 1,600 coins to spend, and I'm hoping to get around four players to five players of how cheap this trading method actually is. So all you're going to put in the search engine is 41212, silver, and 450 coins maximum bid. And you're going to be looking for players with extremely good stats around 400 coins and below, mainly. So I do see this Norton right back. 4122, 81 pace, obviously 4122. Don't know why I said that, but 81 pace, really good stats. I'm putting 250 kind bid on him. I do this, do see this Peshko, who has some also really good stats, but I see this Doombia with some really good stats as well. So I'll put a 250 kind bid on him. Just check the Norton if it's still winning him. I also come across this Hernandez right mid, who I checked for 4 star skill, 4 star weak foot. I do put a bid on him as well, who has got some really good stats. And also you want to be looking at the league, because some leagues tend to be more popular than others and sell a lot more quickly. Like that Mita Liga, who is in a, I think that it's the Eisen Liga or something like that. I'm not completely sure, but I do not bid on him because of the league he is in and how unpopular that league is. But I do put it in that Foster, 84 pace, some really good stats on him. And this Oralana, who I say 85 pace, 84 dribbling. 4 star score, 4 star weak foot, so some really good stats on him. I would like to win him in the end. I come across this Dubai, Dragette, this Sarpong, who is actually a really good player. I tried him on seasons once. And also this Almaback, who is at 350 coins. I do know, who, do know he goes for, go for more than at least 2k. In the 4 2 2 position, anyways. But I do get a bit in that doing, but I do win these two players. And I was hoping to win those two players. Cause they're not, and I wasn't expecting to get a bit in them either. But I do get a bit in this Foster. Put a bid on him again. And also this Aurelana. Who I can't put a bid on again. So I'm just going to leave him there. Thinking that I might get a bid on the Alma back. And put some bids on that. On the left mid Aurelana. So I do eventually win this Foster. So I, who I didn't do think he goes around 1,500 coins in the front run two formation, but I could be mistaken. But hopefully we'll make some profit on him. I do I do put some bids on the Aurelana. I'm not too sure on these players' prices, but I do know they would go for go for more than 1k. So I keep putting bids on this Aurelana, keep getting that bid over and over. And I do get a bid again, and I think I can't put any more bids on Aurelana. So do you remove him in the watch from the watch list in the end? But still looking at his armor back, waiting till the time goes down, waiting till the 16 seconds. The reason you put, and I probably will put put an episode up of why you bid at 16 to 15 seconds or 15 15 to 20 seconds in between there, and it wasn't. Another YouTube videos and video. I can't remember which channel, but I learnt that to bid at 16 seconds. I will probably put an episode on about why to bid at 60 second mark. But I do put 450 coin bid at that price. Then it does go up for 2,700 coins. And I'm going to be moving there. But I did hope you like this trading method. I did pick up three players who I'm going to make around 1k on hopefully. And so you can make quite a lot of coins in a lot of quantity with this method. But hope you like the video. Thanks for watching, like and subscribe.